Okay, before we get started with our standing crunchless abs, I'd like for you to meet Madison, and I want you to meet Jericho. Now, Jericho is gonna show you the modifications of each exercise, but right now, we've gotta warm up. You ready? Yeah. Let's get warmed up. Okay, bend your knees slightly, and I just want you to punch laterally, and alternate that punch. Good, but I really want you to twist to the side. We're trying to really fire up the entire core for what's to come. This is a good way to make that connection with the muscle that you're gonna be working. And that is core. Good, breathe out, breathe, breathe right there. Three, two, and one. Hands behind your head, and I just want you to lift, tap, and alternate. Just lift, tap. Now I want you to slightly round your back as you bring your knee up. So you gotta round your back on these, these standing abs for them to be engaged. So round slightly. All right, keep it moving. You might feel a little of this in your quad, that's all right. Give me three, two, one. Fantastic. Okay, pick up your weight. Overhead, I just want you to reach up with your leg. Good. Go for the shin. You can have a slight knee bend, but really get up there as high as you can and keep the arms straight. All right, how you doing? I'm good. I'm coming over to you. How can we make her better? How can we make this workout harder? You can find it. I know I can. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to really reach for that shin. So it's like they're almost tapping on that shin. You feel that? Straight leg. Now, see, now look at that face. That's a game face. That's a I'm working harder face. All right, let's look at our mod. How are you doing? How can I make it harder on you? Oh, I don't know. All right, let's try. Good, you've got that leg straight. You're reaching for the shin. How about going even a little beyond? All right. Okay, try it. There you go. Ah, I knew it. I knew I could make it harder on that modifier. Keep it moving. Good. And two, one. Shake it out, let's move on. Now, leg to the side, and I want you to power into the knee. Power into it. Good, just tap, power. Excellent. Good, really reach up. Reach up in that diagonal. Excellent. I like that one. All right, you've got 10 seconds on this side. Keep moving. Keep staying motivated. Work with them and follow their form. Give me three, two, one. Now we're gonna change sides. Here I come. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, see, there's really nothing I can do here because this is perfect. You're actually going beyond your knee line. See how she's going, boom, to the way outer part of her leg? That's more challenging. If you can do that, push yourself to do that. Sky is the limit here. Only you limit yourself, so really go for it in this. Nice. How are we doing? I'm gonna fight. Okay, oh, oh my goodness, look at this energy. Okay, I'm backing up from there. Mm -mm. No, I don't want any of that. Give me three, two, one. Fantastic. Let's move on, pick up your other weight. Okay, I want you to get down, and I want you to punch it out, and I want you to go for that toe. Really punch. And if you can, reach to the outer toe, beyond the pinky. Get that twisting motion going. Twist, twist. Good, excellent. Keep moving. All right, how you doing? What do you think I'm gonna make you do? I, no I think I'm gonna make you go lower an inch, really twist. That's right. Straighten that arm each time. Good. How you doing, Jericho? Still okay, she's still fighting this one. This one's a little fighter. Yeah, no, no, no. yeah, I don't want to run into you in the alley after this workout because I know it's not going to be pleasant. <laughs> Good. Keep it moving. Twist. Twist. Got about 10 seconds left. And three, two, one. Amazing. Put your weight down. One leg back, and I want you to rotate. 
Give me an extreme rotation. Really twist. Again, your eyes are following that weight so you can get that rotation. Boom. Good. Good. Keep that moving. Now, her quads engaged too. Like I say, the more muscles you can work, the better. Why not? Why not get the abs and the quads, right? And then when I do a little of this, this is what I do to my clients. I just punch them out a little bit so they really feel that burn. She's going to sock me in the face, totally. Good. You've got three, two, one. I'm having fun with this. Switch sides. OK, how, what can I do to you? Good, go. Come on, rotate. Rotate. Touch. Touch me, come on. Pow. Excellent. I like it. I like it. That's what we call intensity. Whenever you do the movement with controlled intensity, it's more effective. You want that, controlled intensity. A look should be on your face. An attitude should be there. Keep that moving. Give me three, two, one. Excellent. Good. I want you to shake it out. Amazing job. OK, next move. We're going to go right into it. Straight press with a leg raise, and I want you to alternate. Really push out. Key is to round that back as you reach for the toe. Reach for it. Definitely get up to that shin. And exhale. Right there. Right there. Good. And I want you to push from the chest. Don't go low. Don't go high. Go right from the chest, mid-chest line. How you doing? I'm good now that you're back here. Uh-huh. Really? Do you mean that? She's so sincere right now. Good. Let's make it a little harder for her, for that sincerity. Okay. Let's go a little higher. A little? A little higher. Can you feel that? Yeah. An inch with this workout makes all the difference in the world, as in everything in life, don't uh -huh. you think? <laughs> OK. All right, how you doing? I'm on my way. I'm coming your way. Come on, get that leg higher. Come on, you're the little boxer, you're the kickboxer. I know you have it in you. Excellent, give me three, two, and one. We're gonna go right into a split lunge flex. Bring it up to your head, and down you go. Go for that knee, round your back out. Really round, bring it in and contract right there. Contract. Give it that contraction. Look, you gotta work for this burn with the standing abs. You gotta really contract. That mind muscle connection is so key. I cannot say it enough. I cannot say it enough. How are we doing back here? All right. Are you a little dizzy? Uh, yeah. You can feel a little dizzy. Three, two, and give me one more. Switch legs. All right. Now let's see that contraction. Rounding out, you're going for that knee. Yes, ma'am. All right, I want you to touch that elbow to knee every time. Every time? Every single time. That's what I want you to do at home. You go for the elbow to the knee to get the maximum out of this. How are we doing, babe? I'm working. Good. And contract. Contract, let me feel it. I want your abs. You want my abs? This is how to get them. This is the routine that I do for myself because I cannot stand crunches. Give me three. Two, and one, good. All right, let's move on. Get into a squat position, and I want you to rotate, really rotate. Now look, my hips are stable. They are not working. Common thing with clients is they want to rotate that hip. You don't want to rotate that hip. You want all the work to be done right here in the core. So you've got to really twist it out in the core. Let me get down a little bit more. All right, we've got about 10 seconds left. Sit into it. It's OK to feel your legs. Why not get more bang for your buck? Give me two and one. Now we got to switch sides. Switch it up and rotate. Uh-huh. Look what I'm going to do to her. I'm going to make her go down just a little bit. See how I squatted more? That's you. Now you're squatting more. Give me that rotation. There you go. You real? Oh, oh, excuse me, show off. That's a rotation. Good. Nice job. I've got no correction for you. That's fantastic. Good. Get down there and up. Good. Give me three, two, and one. Fantastic. Shake it out. Now, all you're going to do is let that weight drop down past your knee and then boom, power it up into a military. Power it up. Good. Punch up to the sky. 
Controlled movement. Don't throw your shoulder out. Everything should be resisting against the downward and pushing upward. Good. Should feel this boom, boom, right here. Excellent. Keep it moving. Give me three, two, one, and let's move to the other side. Good. And down, up, down, up. Do I need to correct you guys back there? Do I need to come back? Let's see how you're doing. Good. Reach down past that knee. Excellent. Chin up. Eyes forward. Good job. You're pretty good. Just keep our movement at home. Stay with us. Give me three, two, and one. Fantastic. Good. Shake it out. Okay, let's go right into a squat swing. I want you to swing it and up. Really stretch overhead. I want that core to be stretched out right there. Good. Swing it and up. Good. And breathe on the upward motion. Breathe out. How are we doing? I'm fantastic. All right. You look fantastic. Mm -hmm. We usually use a kettlebell in the gym to do this, but a weight is fine, right? You ringing my bell? <laughs> I could. <laughs> All right. Keep that swing going. Up. Good. She's got perfect form, but guess what? I'm gonna make it a little harder on her because I like to pick on this one. I like to make her go a little lower. All right, you only have about 25 more seconds. How are we doing? Yeah, you love it? Looks pretty easy for you. There we go. I'm gonna make it a little harder for you. How about that? They're like, get away from me, why don't you? All right, give me three, two, and one, fantastic. Now, I want you to kind of hunker down. We're gonna do a torso twist. So twist, twist. Good, now you gotta round your back on this. You gotta contract as you go. Contract as you go. Twist it out. You don't need to round that much, honey. Just a little bit. Just a little bit, there you go. Now, you might be feeling your quads engaged in this. That's fine. We like to work mus multiple muscles, right? We love it, don't we? I absolutely You want to do it more? I knew you were going to do it. <laughs> there we go, squat down. All right, good job. How about you? You want to work your... I want to turn this up. I do want to turn it up. I always want to turn it up. Down you go. Love it. All right, let's keep moving. I'm squat low. You guys can squat low. All right, we've got about 10 seconds left. Stay with it. Really, boom, torso. Get engaged there. Give me three, two, and one. Fantastic. We're going to go right into figure eight, and that's exactly what it says. Just a nice figure eight in front. Make it wide. Here, I'm going to widen it for you. Wide. Nice big one. You know why? More twisting. So, lower body, stable. All upper body movement in that diagonal figure eight for that twist, right? Yeah. You got a big one going. I got a big one going. Good. Get abs like yours. Oh, honey, you got abs like yeah. mine. Get it a little lower. Lower? Yeah, a little lower. Okay. All right. Excellent. We're halfway there. Keep moving. Keep it with us. I, and <laughs> what are you doing? She's this is like a club move right here. Okay, uh, even a bigger, even a bigger figure eight. I want to see a bigger one. A bigger one. Good. That's great. Okay? Keep moving it out. 10 seconds, you guys. You are almost there. Engage. Give me three, two, and one. Fantastic. Now we're gonna push out as we tap behind us. Push to the side. Boom, all your might. Come on. There you go. Tap and push. Tap and push. You know what I'm gonna do. Here's my invisible focus mitt. Right there. Good, get that twist going. That's good, you should be actually making noise and sweating and feeling this at home. I want you to get into it. Good. All right, give me three more, two more, one. Now switch sides. Let's go. Good. You're like doing a stop in the name of love action going in here. She's really, she's got the Broadway in her right now, for sure. Right here, good. 
Good. Power it out. No, 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 no. I think you do want to dance, honey. I think you want to dance bad. <laughs> We've got about 10 seconds to go. Great. Push it out. And three, two, one. Fantastic. Put your weight down. Let's go right into a cool down. Just stretch up. Reach. Breathe. Please breathe. Reach to the other side. And now down. Let your head drop into the mat. Reach to one leg. And now to the other. Just let your abs stretch out. Come up and breathe. Roll your shoulders back. That is a great job. Keep it up and you're gonna get those flat, sexy abs in no time. Before we get started with our floor crunchless abs, I'd like you to meet Madison and Jericho. Now Jericho is gonna help you through the modifications for all the exercises. Right now, we've gotta warm up. So, I want you guys to kneel down and you're just gonna reach up, straight to the ceiling, really reach. A little bit of twist, but the goal is to just open up that torso and reach. Also, breathe, so exhale as you're reaching up. Good. The key is that you wanna start feeling those abdominals. They should be firing a little bit, even on this warm up. Okay, give me three, two, one. Let's do a torso twist. Just twist it out. The hips, they stay stable. This is just a twisting motion in the torso. Make the abs work, make the abs stretch. Good. Keep it up. You've got 10 more seconds. Okay, give me three, two, one. Let's go right into the routine. I want you to grab a weight, down on your back, squeeze it between your knees, and you're gonna reach down and up in a twisting motion, elbow to knee. So drop it and bring it in. Drop it, bring it in. I want you to focus right here. Good. All right, let's see how you guys are doing. Here I come. How are we doing? Good. Hey, how about this? You want me to make you drop it a little bit more? Yeah, okay. A little drop? Yes. Where's the, why is that elbow not to the knee? There you go. <laughs> the goal is to bring the elbow to the knee, and the more you drop it, the better, but I'm more concerned with making that connection. Just give me three, two, one more. Good. All right, how are you doing? All right. You breezing through this? No way. Let me see. Dro get that elbow to knee. There we go. Now we made it a little tougher on her. It's just too easy on this girl. We gotta toughen it up. Thank you, Jackie. You're welcome. I know you're happy about that. All right. Let me finish it out with you guys. We're gonna drop it, bring it in. We've got about 10 seconds. Keep it moving. Hey, don't stop through this. You can shorten the motions, but I don't want you to stop. Give me three, two, and one. Fantastic, put the weight down, stabilize your back, and we're gonna go right into swimmers. So this is exactly how they sound, they're swimmers. That's the motion you make with your legs, you're paddling. This is really good lower abdominal work right here. Right? Now watch what I'm gonna do to them. <laughs> this is what I do to my clients. Karate chop them. Right here. Get the lower and the upper abs really engaged. You like that? It's mean. It's mean? No, 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 I'm doing them a favor. Hey, you gotta, look at the six pack. Okay, you're right. That came with a price tag, let me tell you. You want some of that? You know I can't wait. <laughs> Let's go. Please don't Come on. sit on me. Tighten it up, tighten it up. Exactly. Any mouth from you, I'm going to sit on you. That's even worse. I've done it. It hurts. It hurts. Good. All right. Let's keep it moving. Straighten those legs. Keep them locked. Give me three, 
two, one. Fantastic. Go right into a side plank, up on the elbow, right into it, and reach to that knee. And out. Good. Just elbow to knee, and out. Okay, good. You feel this directly in the obliques. Right here. This is where you want to go rock hard. Okay? How are we doing? Good. Chin up, babe. There you go. Chin up. You open it up and you close it. You want that motion. And you want to reach for that elbow. There we go. Now you got it. How's that feel? Good. You like it when I correct? <laughs> I don't think you do. All right, keep it up, babe. You're doing great. Good, keep it up at home. You're doing fantastic. Let's switch sides. Switch that side. Okay, you ready? Got my eye on you. And reach elbow to knee. Come on, touch it. There you go, touch it. Hate me now, love me later. I always say that. Okay, so <laughs> even if you modify this, that's fine. You go ahead and modify it by bending your uh, leg behind you, but you gotta still touch elbow to knee. So go for it. That's it, you gotta do that. Okay, let's get right back into it and keep it up. You only have about seven more seconds. Crunch that out. Give me three, two, one. Fantastic. Now, I love a good plank. So we're gonna twist and twist. So drop those hips into your mat. Drop it and drop it. Simple plank twist. There you go, let's see. How are we doing? Good. Good, drop those hips, boom. All right, you feel that? Mm -hmm. You guys, right here, this is where the action's happening, right here in the obliques. But because it's a plank, it's a great core workout. Remember, you can't have sexy abs without having a sexy low back. You gotta have that, you're halfway there. Keep it moving, just twist, twist. Follow their form, just do it. Okay, even if you drop to your knees, keep your back straight and get those hips down and that twisting motion happening. She's still getting a workout in the abs, okay? Excellent, keep it up. Twist, give me three, two, and one. Fantastic. All right, just go into a child's pose and stretch it out. Okay, let's move into a V-toe touch. So sit down, and I want you to reach for each toe, alternate it, and the point is to lean back and come forward, round your back out when you come forward, and contract. Good. Breathe out as you reach for that toe. All right, how are you guys doing? Are you reaching? Let's see. I'll be the judge of that. Good. I love how she's leaning back. She's really getting that lean back, so there's more of an opening and a closing, more of a contraction. Good, really reach for that toe. Less knee, more reach. Ah, uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> she's like, yay, I feel it now. How are we doing? Okay, you're doing great. You're reaching for it. I think you could reach a little bit more. A little bit more, there you go. Back and reach, good. All right, let's do a few more of these. Good, and three, two, one. Excellent. Grab your weights, lift your legs up into a 90 degree, and we're just gonna do swimmers with the arms. Now, here's the key, get those shoulder blades off the ground. Get them off the ground. Breathe out. Every time there's movement, there's a breath out. So, good. There you go, I should hear you guys. Excellent, uh-huh. What can I do with you? How can we make this harder? That's what I always do with my clients. How can I give them more bang for their buck? And this is how you do it. Lift those shoulders up, there you go. Now you're in the zone, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can't talk, huh? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. She doesn't have a lot to say to me right now. She's 30 seconds in. Keep it up, keep it up, babe. That's it. Chin up to the ceiling. You got it. You got it. All right, how you doing over here? All right, she's got the movement going. 90 degrees. She's still engaged. She's still engaged. All right. And let's do three, two, 
One, perfect. All right, this is a little more challenging. And it's gonna get your heart rate up. These are burpees, so you go out and in. Out and in. That back stays straight, don't let those hips dip. Good, keep that nice wide stance. Whew. You're gonna feel that big time in the core. But what I love about a burpee is that you feel it in your hip flexors. So to get that nice little cut right there, this is what you do. It's hard to get that cut, but this is the kind of stuff. Don't you feel it real low? Yes. There you go, keep it up. Get that cut going. Nice. Now, if you have to modify it, you're halfway done by the way, but if you have to modify it, you just bring one leg in, one leg out, but keep that constant fluid motion. Remember, back straight, core tight, excellent. All right. Good. Okay, you've got about 10 seconds left. And three, two, one. Fantastic. All right, we're gonna go into a bridge. One leg out and touch. And just reach for that toe. Try to keep that leg straight and reach up and stay in that holding bridge right there. All right. <laughs> All right. Lift that booty up even more. Lift it. She's like, but I don't want to work my hamstrings. Right? Now look at this nice tight core. All right, good job. Okay, give me three, two, one. Let's move to the other side. Great. All right, so Jericho's not doing a bridge, but she's still got some active movement. So she's still working that hip flexor right there. And you're lifting your shoulder off the ground. That's really important. She's going that diagonal. So she's really activating that side. You feel it? Good. All right, let's keep it moving. And I could do these all day. <laughs> Love these, give me three, two, and one, fantastic. And just bring your knees in and exhale. Okay, I want you to stabilize your back and we're gonna go right into leg circles clockwise. Bring them around, keep the legs as straight as you can. Nice, big circles. Good. All right, let's see how we're doing here. Okay, girl. You can go bigger than that. Bigger. Bigger. Nice, big circles. Engage those lower abdominals. That's right, I got all the time in the world. Well, 30 seconds. Good, keep it up. Keep it up. I want to see this. I want to see it. All right. How you doing? Good. She's got her knees bent. Now, I want you to go the other direction, counterclockwise, okay? Counterclockwise. Keep that back stable, and we're simply bringing it around the other way. Now, when I change that up, I'm really hitting this side, the side I'm touching, it, okay? Good, give me 10 more seconds. Don't forget to breathe, don't hold it. Let's do three, two, one. And because I love my planks, we're gonna go right into it. A plank with a leg lift. So just go ahead and lift that leg while you're holding that plank position. Keep that knee really straight. And that booty should not be up here. It should be nice and straight in that plank position, okay? Good. And up. All right. These aren't so hard. <laughs> Keep it moving. See how we're doing over here. Okay, you can lower that booty down a little bit. Center it. There we go. Made it a little harder, huh? Okay, great. How you doing? Keep it moving. Links, for some reason, are pretty easy for me. I like them. I enjoy them. Let's do three, two, and one. All right, we're going to go right into a leg jack. 
So I want you to open and close, open and close. This is just like a jumping jack, but it's only the legs. And again, you're holding that plank position. Good. Now, this is gonna get your heart rate elevated a little bit. So, heart rate up, get the intensity level up. That's what you want. You want moments of periods of intensity, then bring it down. Periods of intensity, bring it down. You're halfway there. You stay with these leg jacks. How you doing, babe? Yeah, yeah. Keep that booty down, a little more centered to the ground. Legs a little straighter. There you go. That engages the core a little bit more. All right? Okay, good. So Jericho's just, she's opening up one leg, then the other, but still in that plank position, she's doing it. And keep it up. Let's do three, two, and one. All right, let's go right into Superman. So you close and you open in a V. Close and open. Yeah, yeah. Exhale as you come up. Really exhale. Empty those lungs. All right, how are we doing here? Come on, ready? And up. And up. Stay with me. And up. There you go. That's the timing I'm talking about. Stay with us. And up. Good, you've got 30 seconds. All right, great. Now listen, she is working her entire core, that band around lower abdominals and the back. Also, she's engaging her glute and her hamstring, right? Mm -hmm. You feel that? Great. Just keep it moving. Keep it moving. And up. And let's do three more. Three, two, one. Fantastic. Go right into a cobra pose. Open up that chest, breathe, and really stretch those abdominals out because you deserve it. It's great. Hold it. Chin up. Just a couple more seconds. Now let's go into a child's pose, but I want to stretch. Stretch on one side. Breathe. Now move right to the other side. I love this because I feel a nice stretch in my lats, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come up. Take a deep breath in. Yeah. Exhale. Great job. Keep it up, and you're going to get sexy, flat abs in no time. Yeah.